Hey there, collective and Aquarius. Tap in, Aquarius. It's been a minute since I did your reading. Uh, so let's tap into your energy, Aquarius, and see who is this person here who secretly has feelings for you or your person's secret feelings towards you. Now, this could be someone that you know or someone that you've uh, broken up from in separation. It could be somebody who you don't know. So this is a general Aquarius, so only take the part that fits and discard the rest. Now, this is their energy, not yours, their perspective of you. Now, sometimes, you know, it could, it could be somebody from your past who got a bone to pick with you, too. Now, we're going to find out. But if this video and my energy resonates, please like, share, and subscribe to this channel, Aquarius. Thank you so much, and I appreciate you. Spirit, show me the energy of the person, of Aquarius' person here who secretly has feelings for this. What are their secret feelings for Aquarius per spirit? What, what is Aquarius person's secret feelings? Their secret thoughts, their secret feelings towards Aquarius spirit. What is Aquarius person's secret feelings and thoughts towards Aquarius? All right, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Mm. Ooh, the Tower card. You could be dealing with a Scorpio. You could be dealing with a Capricorn. Oof. And there you go, King of Swords, Ten of Swords, oof, the Moon, Temperance. Wow, seems like there is something. You could be dealing with a Capricorn, a Pisces, a Sagittarius, or a Scorpio. Ooh, 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 ooh. Spirit, what's this person secretly feeling about it, Aquarius? What is Aquarius person's secret thoughts and secret feelings? Something has happened here. Queen of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries. The Five of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces here underneath the bottom. Eight of, so <laughs> Eight of Swords, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius energy. And the Six of Swords and the Hierophant. So something happened here. There's a major, there was a horrible ending here that someone did not see coming. Now, maybe someone had an attachment in another situation. Let's see. Let's see. Look, you got, look, this is your energy. You could be dealing with the fire sign here. Now, you, you, I feel like you got somebody here who is beautiful, very attractive here. Uh, I don't know. Maybe, maybe this person was too fast for you. I'm, I'm almost feeling like this queen of wands did you wrong. Or maybe you were a dis... Well, let's, let's just see. I ain't going to even say. Let me see. Let's see. Something came to the light, I feel like, with this moon card. Something came down. Something that was probably... Somebody was trying to hide something and it must have came out. With the tower card and the ten of swords. So let's see. Spirit, clarify Aquarius' person's secret thoughts, secret feelings... Spirit, clarify Aquarius person's secret thoughts and feelings. Spirit, clarify Aquarius's person's secret thoughts and secret feelings. Spirit, Aquarius person's secret thoughts and secret feelings. All right, underneath the bottom, you got that freaking tower card again. You could be dealing with a Scorpio, but they show showing out in your reading. So let's start off with this. Queen, let's start with the Queen of Wands because I feel like you're the King of Swords. <laughs> All right, Spirit. Now, even though if you if you feel like this resonates, you can reverse the roles. But even though I'm telling you that this is your person, this is how they feel. Now, they're going to feel a certain type, type of way based on what is happening between the two of you. Now, their way is their way, just like your way is your way. Everybody has a feeling. Everyone has their side to the story here. It doesn't make it true. It just means that each individual have their own take on it, okay? So, Spirit, what's up with this Queen of Wands for the person with... Um, what, what is Aquarius' person's secret feelings towards them in this Queen of Wands energy? Queen of Wands... Seven of Cups. Ooh. Now, this Queen of Wands may have had options. <laughs> now, see, that's what I was feeling like because I just feel like, I feel like this Queen of Wands may have been a little too rowdy for this King of Swords. Uh, I feel like the King of Swords for this Queen of Wands may be too safe. 
a little too safe. And I feel like your person here may, you may find out that your person had a lot of options here. Now, your person could be saying, no, let me just say, you could, whatever this queen of wands is, their secret thoughts or their secret feelings, and they probably telling you that you're one of their options or that uh, maybe they're confused about who they should be with here. All right, Spirit, what's what's going on with Aquarius' person, secret feelings, and thoughts of this queen of wands? Four of coins here. So this could have been somebody here who either is holding back because they're entertaining other options here. Or this person's holding on to their lifestyle of being this, you know, this have fun, passionate, ain't got to answer to nobody, call your own shots out here, living in the moment, really living life passionately, you know. But I, I feel like, I feel like someone may be finding out you may have found out that your person was holding back because they had other options. All right, Spirit, what's up with this Queen of Wands? Mm. King of Pentacles. Now, there go another masculine, God dang me. You could have found out that your person been somebody swept in and, and, ooh. That's what I feel like, of course. I feel like you were dating some. I feel like you was dating somebody here who was a little too fast for you. And I feel like this person was all about money and fun, okay? And I feel like, like I said, you were a little too safe for this queen of wands. But you could be finding out that this person has been taken care of by somebody else who didn't already. Now, it could have been you that offered your cup of love. But maybe you didn't have enough for this person here. Page of Pentacles. Because you see the king of Pentacles here. It's almost like this person may have held back from you. Because they had a bigger offer here. And you could have been the one that was in love with this person here, but you didn't have much to offer. Or I ain't going to say not much, but maybe not as much as she is, your person was used to. The Knight of Cups. See, you may have came more real too. Because for all your person know, your person could be involved with a married person here. But because they're taking, I feel like they're taking care of her. This, this is what I see. This is what I feel like. See? See, it's almost like you're realizing that this person ain't marriage material. You may be realizing that this person you're with is not marriage material. Wow. So this is what it is. I feel like somebody here is stuck on somebody else because they was providing here. I feel like this you may be finding out that your person here. Now, this is this is them, uh, how they feel. It's almost like they're saying that. Based on this, is that they have that, that they're not gonna release their other options here because their other option is paying them and doing good by them, and they like it as this queen of wands. So this is what your person is holding back from you because they got old sugar daddy over here tricking off with. <laughs> they say you ain't no fun like that king of pentacles. You don't like to go out. You don't like to live. Uh, you, you ain't making it rain on me and things. I can't even tell if you really into me. I don't like that. I want to know you into me like this. What I feel like. This is just what I see. Because I somebody is regretting it. I feel like it's you. So let's check out this King of Swords. Spirit, what's up with this King of Swords? Now, this is from their perspective, how they feel. Now, Spirit, what is going on? What is Aquarius' person's secret feelings and thoughts towards Aquarius in this King of Swords energy? What's up this King of Swords? Y'all, they got here popping them firecrackers. You know what time it is. Wheel of Fortune. Mm. so destiny karma good luck here you may have felt like this was a good opportunity for you or maybe this person was i feel like you met this person for i feel like your person wasn't looking for nothing that's just all i see the knight of wands i feel like this is your person I feel like your person just seized an opportunity with you, but I feel like they wasn't, because I feel like your person is out here, okay? And I ain't going to say out here. It's almost like you're dealing with an alpha female here, okay? What guys usually do, I feel like your chick is doing this. Uh, she's she's kind of, she's kind of, uh, she's kind of bouty bouty with it here. And I like, I feel like you were just a little too safe for this person here. Now, Let's see. What else? What else? Well, what's going on with this King of Swords for this person's secret thoughts here? 
King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. The chariot here. See? See, I feel like this person is an on-the-go type of person. See, this person is chasing your person. This, this is what your person is saying about you, Aquarius. They say that you will only slow them down. They say you would only slow them down because they said that I feel like your person feels like you wanted to cuff them. You wanted to slow them down. You wanted them all to yourself. And, and I feel like you had an attachment. I feel like you was trying to tame a wild bitch. Okay. <laughs> no pun intended. I feel like you was trying to tame someone here that didn't want to be tamed because they were on a journey here and they were intended on getting it. Somebody already saw a purpose in their life and you did not fit in with it because you were too comfortable and your person felt like you were only going to slow them down because they're over here in the Queen of Wands energy going for what they want here, entertaining other options. It's almost like this person is pursuing who, whoever got that bag, whoever, whoever is the thing popping, whatever's going to get this person to their goals or to their destiny here because they're pursuing it passionately here. The Knight of Wands and the Chariot, like I'm saying, this person is intending on getting it. And I feel like they didn't see that drive. They felt like you were too safe, too comfortable, and you will only slow them down and get in the way. But they want somebody here who is a go-getter, somebody here who is out here flexing and stunting and about to show them the good life. Because I feel like this is what somebody feels like. They feel like somebody feels like they're destined for a lavish life. A high, a high society life here. A spotlight life here. All right, Spirit, what's up with the tower? Could be a Scorpio. Could be a Cancer. Could be Aquarius, Taurus, Aquarius, or Leo, too. Knight of Wands, King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries. Now you got the Scorpio in the tower. All right, Spirit, what is Aquarius' person's secret feelings and thoughts about Aquarius in this tower energy? The tower, Seven of Pentacles. See, somebody started taking stock. Your person did. And your person here, I like I feel like your person is somebody here that's that's restless here. Your person is looking for the biggest hit, okay? This is why you got this King of Pentacles here. It's almost like your person said that they could hold back from you, and then it could represent this person still holding on to this to this uh investor here. But I feel like your person here is realizing that. I feel like they probably realizing that it wasn't gonna go anywhere between the two of you because it's almost like you guys were on two different, maybe reaching for different things. I feel like you wanted somebody to be with, but this person like, uh-uh, I'm trying to go to the stars. I'm trying to go to the freaking moon. Spirit, what's up with the tower here? See, Ace of Pen, this person going where the money at, see? This person's going where the financial opportunities are coming in at. It's what I feel like. I feel like this person just feels like like, I feel like you're dealing with somebody here, a fem feminine energy that know what they want. And, and they don't mean no harm, but they, but they they like they living like the guys do. Five of Wands here. See, because I feel like this person may have a lot of different uh, opportunities. See, it's almost like you're dealing with somebody here who likes the limelight, who likes exciting things. Uh, they're always going to draw a crowd. They're always going to have... Uh, uh, different energies, different options around them at any given time. This person is never going to be alone. So if you've met this person here, I feel like you approach this person. because I don't feel like this is somebody here who chases. I feel like this is somebody here who is confident in their sexuality, whatever lifestyle they live, they're comfortable with it. And ain't nobody going to knock them off. Whatever they do for a living, they, they do for a living, how they get their money, how they get their money. And they don't need nobody over here uh, 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 that ain't about that life because this is somebody here who likes to travel. They always in this street. Somebody always flying all over the world. This is somebody here who gets hooked up with, with uh, real bosses here. So see, this is why they're going. This person took stock of you guys' relationship and of you. And I feel like it hit them. It could have hit them or maybe it hit you. Maybe this is what you're realizing here. But this is from their perspective. Somebody had a tower moment, but I feel like it affected you. That somebody started taking stock and they realized that they, they, want, they want money. They want growth. They, this is what they want. They want the money. And they probably felt like they couldn't get it with you. 
It's feel like this person may have had a lot of options here. And I feel like somebody's gone to the highest bidder, god dang it. So now you have the devil. You could be dealing with the Capricorn. Spirit, what's up this devil card here for the person who with secret thoughts and feelings towards Aquarius? What do they feel secretly about Aquarius and this devil energy to be a Capricorn? The devil, six of wands, see? I tell you, this person craves attention, and this person gets a lot of attention. I'm hearing OnlyFans. I'm hearing OnlyFans. Uh, this person may have an OnlyFans page. This person could very well have an OnlyFans page. And it's like, I don't be thinking I'm finna, don't be trying to take me home to meet your mama. I didn't say I want to meet your mama. Oh, you got a little girl? Well, that's so cute. Well, look here, I'm going to have to holler at you. This is somebody here who ain't on their level. This ain't no, this ain't no baby mama energy. This ain't no, this ain't no selling down energy. This is the I get around energy, okay? Where, where, where they have done something strange for some change here. And the only thing they would do is turn you out and have your world upside down. And I feel like this is what's happening. Somebody here who gets a lot of attention here. You got justice here. Oof. Wow, this person here could be, I feel like this person demands attention here. All right, Spirit, why is the devil here? Why is this here? This could be somebody here that's uh, in a karmic, filling out their karma here. Knight of coins, there it is, see there? See there, because the attention that this person gets, it brings in money. See, she do whatever this queen of wands do. She do things to get the attention for people to bring money. See, this ain't this ain't no housewife energy. What what spirit is telling you? Get gone, let this one go. You ain't losing nothing. Is what spirit is telling you, Aquarius? You ain't lost nothing. You you missing out on a heartache and pain in the long haul here. She see. This person probably rejected love. This person ain't looking for no love. If they come and talk, if they come around here trying to settle down with this one and honor her, she's going to reject it. But if you come talking about that pinnacle, she's going to get down with you. And I feel like you came in wanting something different with this person. But you realize this person is untamed. They ain't, you, you ain't got nothing that they want. They going to run rings around you and have you broken. And maybe this is what happened. Now you got the Ten of Swords. What's up this Ten of Swords? But this is your energy. Let's see. Why is the Ten of Swords here for the person, for Aquarius' person and their secret thoughts and feelings towards Aquarius? Ten of Swords, judgment. Somebody may be receiving karma here. It could be your person. That's probably why that justice card came up. I feel like your person may have been just too goddamn me cold here. And I feel like your person may be about to receive karma here because after all, you got that will of fortune. I feel like your person may be receiving karma some type of way because I feel like this is somebody here who is very, very impulsive. Uh, they don't have any constraints. They don't have children, so they don't have any obligations. They don't have nothing stopping them from doing whatever they want to do to the point where it's dangerous, I feel like. Because this person gets a lot of unhealthy attention on them, and I feel like I feel like this person gets down for money if the money is right, and I feel like it's dangerous. All right, Spirit, why is the Ten of Swords here? could be a Taurus. Three of Cups. See? I feel like this is you calling and you probably like, look, I don't want to be another. This is there. Go to Justice card again. Libra energy. I feel like what you're saying is that, look here, I'm tired. <laughs> now, maybe they're calling it here. Somebody's asking for justice. But like I said, it could be this person receiving karma too. You got judgment, three of cups. It could be how this person has been, have been behaving here too. I feel like someone is very, very inconsiderate and reckless. It's almost like this the energy of somebody here who would charm up to you. And then if they realize you ain't no boss or you ain't got the kind of money that they used to make and they're going to start treating you like crap. And I feel like this is how this one was doing. Once they realize you ain't no boss, then they're going to start treating you nasty. Even though they shaking their ass or they on only fans or they doing something that's getting money. Could be, look, they could look now, 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 okay? They doing something, god dang it, that, 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 that this is not a mama, daddy, a family appropriate energy. This ain't nobody going to take home. This somebody you freak at nights. But you got to have them coins too. You want to buy this one something. Because this is what they used to. They used to that money. So now you got the moon card. I feel like a lot of things, are, I feel like 
Your person held, held, held a lot of secrets. Your person had a whole secret life going on here. A whole secret life. Spirit, why is the moon here? It could be dealing with the Pisces. Spirit, what's up with this moon card here for Aquarius this person's secret thoughts and feelings? The moon is the two of staffs here. Because I feel like this person here is on this journey in their life and they're having to make up. This is somebody here has unresolved issues from their past and their childhood. This is why this person keeps on repeating the same cycle in their life. That's why you got the will of fortune here. That's why you got judgment. You got justice. You got all of these cards here and you got temperance here. It's because somebody may be having daddy issues. Someone could have had a horrible childhood here and they don't deal with it. They suppress it and it acts out in other ways in their life. This is someone here who uh, equates uh, money, materialistic things with uh, success here because they don't value their body. They don't value themselves. So they could have been violated. In, in, look. So now you got the moon card here. See, this person needs to address their issues from their past, from their childhood here. But it's like they got a lot of secrets here that they don't want to address because then they got to deal with it and they, they don't want to deal with it. Because then I feel like then they got to stop doing what they're doing. Because now they feel like they got an excuse to live this way. They're, they're, they're broken. All right, Spirit, the moon. Oof. See? The lover's card, the ten of pentacles. See, this is this how your person get down. It's about the money. But all of her relationships are going to be toxic, though. But she'll still hang in there if the price is right. But what spirit is telling this person, they need to soul search and pull back and just to heal. This is what your person is. Your person is stuck on money. So they make very bad choices. And it's like this person not going to want no good guy. They're not going to want no guy who get up and work hard. And, and they may not be making no heck of a heck of a lot, but they do good enough. They don't gonna want that type of person. They want somebody here with some big gold chains on, some gold in their mouth, somebody here with a nice car. Someone wants some external bull crap. They want they like the they like the look of success. Even though they are damaged on the inside, is what spirit is saying. It's what this person grew up. This person is is damaged. This person is damaged. All right, now you got the temperance card. All right, so what's up with this temperance for a um, one more card for the moon card here? Wow, y'all, this is deep. Ten of Wands, because this person needs to release this burden because it's acting out in somebody's adult life. They've been living this way for the for the longest time here. I feel like this person don't want no children because if they did, if they ever get conceived, then you know what they did with them babies. And them just tell me what I see. It's because it's something about a childhood. Somebody don't want to have to worry about no child because they felt like didn't nobody take care of them and look out for them. And the last thing they want to have to do is worry about somebody else because they know how rough it is out here in these streets. But this is someone here's perception that is damaged. Because they view it, everybody is, I feel like some, all right, temperance, spirit, why is temperance here? I'm sorry, Aquarius, you're reading the guy deep here. What's up with this temperance, spirit? Wow, this person needs to balance themselves out. Be patient with themselves, pull back. Eight of pentacles, because I feel like all this person do is hustle. Eight of Pentacles. And I feel like this person, when it comes to money, they throw caution to the wind and they go in. And I feel like it's dangerous. Page of Swords. See, this is all this person doing. She's looking for the next hit. And I feel like Spirit is kind of warning this person, though. Spirit's telling somebody, you need to back off. You, you need to chill. It ain't safe out here. You can't. Get, it's almost like somebody may be finessing here. Somebody could be a finesser or a setup chick. For somebody, somebody trapping or doing something they ain't got no business doing. But this is what they doing. They 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 scoping out people who got money here. I just feel like they always this your queen of wands is always looking for the next hit. So like like I feel like if this person is not with you, it's your protection here. See, cause this is person here is hungry and greedy. Hungry and greedy and aggressive about money and about her partners. Very confrontational. And I feel like spirit is calling this person to, to take a break. You know, calm down. You, you, you're focusing on the wrong things. And you're going to have to check your pattern, how you're living. This person could be making enemies. 
But I feel like somebody was a set-up girl, too. See? Because it's love for this person. I feel like this is universal love for somebody to heal. Because right now, this person don't want no love. They want money. See? Because they defeated. So now you got the five of cups. It could be your person feeling defeated. It's almost like your person may be thinking about the good guy now. You know how they say the good guy always comes in last? Almost like your person may have had to been run through the gutter just for them to realize that they had a good, decent guy. But they wasn't paying attention to this good, decent guy because they had issues. They didn't trust the good, innocent. They didn't trust the decent guy. They trusted the, the, the appearance of happiness. Man, because somebody, somebody's on, got an OnlyFans page. All right, five of cups. Why is the five of cups here, Spirit? Clarify the five. Of, why is the five of cups here? For Aquarius, this person's secret feelings and thoughts could be Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. Your person could be watching you too, two of swords. And this could be your person here. Page of cups. See, I feel like your person has a lot of regret. Not, it's like your person is regretting not 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 acknowledging the uh, love that you was trying to show them. Because I feel like this person's realizing ain't no love out here. Because of the, it's not any love out here because they're not vibrating on their frequency. They vibrating on the get money, get scheming, scheming, out for the the biggest dollar, doing something strange for a little change. They out they out like that. This person out like that. So this person is regretting it. Now, like I said, this person is wishing that they had that good, simple, nerdy, uh, don't, don't, don't do all that other stuff type of energy now. See, because this is all this person does is think about you. And when they think about you, that's the only time your person has hope. See? Because your person losing hope. Your person is in a bad place, but they need to heal. Your person is full of regret because they realized that you were the only genuine energy that was trying to show them love. Because then now, now they out here in this rough, rough world having to, to do some strains for money. Because they got this addiction. It's like this person wants to wants that life. And they and, and, and they went to sleep on you because they say you was too, you, you would only slow them down. You was too comfortable. They they needed thug life. N now that they get it, that they're not liking it so much now. And now they're wishing that they would have taken you a little bit more serious. But this is how your person secretly feels about your queries. If it resonates, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.